Hi, I'm Peregrine, and these are five novel ways to wrap presents. If someone asks you for something boring, and you still want to give them a memorable gift, this is the video for you. This way here is uh, my new favorite, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that one last. Number one, prize inside. Let's say you're getting someone three pairs of socks. Rather than wrapping the socks together in a single package, go to the grocery store and buy six different grocery items. Open each one and bury a single saran wrap sock near the bottom of it. For added wow factor, take a tiny bit of super glue and carefully reseal each item so it'll open like new. Then write prize inside on each one. Wrap them up and you're all done. Enjoy the rising confusion and hilarity as they dig through each item, trying to find their gift. No way! Let me know when you see a prize. Yes, <laughs> Amazing! Oh, uh... I see a prize. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Hey, there's a prize inside. No way! <laughs> Number two, the ribbon monologue. E-gift cards are a 10 out of 10 for convenience, but a negative 500 out of 10 for unwrapping experience. Here's how you can change that. Make a stiff cardboard back placard that announces the e-gift card they're receiving. Now write an absurd monologue or series of pun-filled jokes, more grown-worthy the better, that hint at what their gift is. Now painstakingly copy that monologue onto an entire ribbon using a marker. Then, starting with where the story ended, wrap that ribbon around the placard until the whole thing is covered. I love the way these look. Make sure the beginning of the ribbon story sticks out invitingly for them to begin their reading and unwrapping adventure. You wrote this? Yeah. Here are some fun salmon facts. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. 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 Oh my gosh. Cute. Those are the greatest, corniest one-liners I've ever heard. That is the worst <laughs> joke I have ever heard. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know the answer to these questions. Maybe you can ask REI. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, REI. That's true. Number three, the redirect. This one is like if M. Night Shyamalan gave a present. You give your friend a nice festive gift bag with a balloon and inside they find the present inside a box. But when they unwrap the box, boom, you hit them with a twist. There's no present there. Just a pin and a sign that says, you know what to do. Turns out the present was inside the balloon the whole time. And they have to use the pin to pop the balloon to get your gift. Woo! <laughs> Turns out it's not too hard to get gift cards or USB drives inside a balloon with a bunch of confetti. Number four the long gift. Gifting someone multiple neckties or belts, don't diminish their longness by coiling them up in a box. Embrace their longitude. Attach them end to end and wrap the whole thing to create the world's longest present. Enjoy as they have to unwrap a room-length present in front of everyone. Number five, the disguise. So you really wanna make sure your friend won't have a clue what their gift is? No problem. Just construct the skeleton of another random object out of cardboard and hot glue. Sounds time consuming? It is, but it is worth it. Then you take their present and you hide it inside. Wrap the whole thing up and you guarantee complete confusion and laughter when you bring it out for them. This is actually what I'm doing for my partner for Christmas this year. Um, I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna post a reaction on Twitter, so if you wanna see it, subtle hint to follow my Twitter. Anyway, that's the video. I hope you liked it. I hope it inspired you in some way. I love comments. So please leave a comment with which one your favorite was and if you have any other creative ways of presenting presents to people. I would love to see them and I would love to read them and reply to them. That's it for this video. Now I'm gonna go practice pretending this thing is heavy. Miming skills, here we go. Awesome! It's so trippy!